Hey guys, Masterfar here, welcoming you all to 2019, and I'm back with another custom. Now, I know what you're all thinking. Who the hell is this? I don't know who this is. I've never heard of this character. He doesn't look like anything. Well, here's the thing. Given how my best Transforming Collection challenge went down, I decided, uh, why not do another challenge? And this time, I've created Build-A-Bot, or B-Squared. Now, here are some ground rules for uh, the challenge itself. I'm going to start by uh, tagging a few friends, uh, Dennis Moulton, A.K. Gotbot, Tia Fan Geek, and Ninja Bill. Now, the rules are simple. Go nuts. Basically, you can make any Transformer you want. Like, make... Here's the gist. Make a new character. And there are a few rules. Like, here's rule number one. It's got to have a bio. You can make it... That's the only rule you really have to abide by. It can be whatever you want. It can be whatever faction. It can transform to whatever Cybertronian Earth or Earth mode. It can uh, be an all about Decepticon, male or female. Basically, go nuts. The world is your oyster. Now, I am contemplating doing a contest on this, and the winner will get a little prize uh, based on which one I think is the best. Anyway, aside from that, uh, yeah, I tagged a few people, and let's talk about an example. This is is Thresher, a Decepticon Viacon I created. Now, for his bio, I am saying that uh, in order to combat the auto troopers led by Checkpoint, Shockwave has created the Viacons. However, they need a general to lead them, so we create Thresher. Now, Thresher is a weird one. He doesn't talk that much, but God, the uh, auto troopers not like him. Also, unlike the auto troopers, which to me probably have like a portion of a spark, Shockwave gave a Thresher a full spark. Who knows who it was, it's just he has a spark. Now, he's uh, risen through the ranks and has become a rival of Checkpoint, leader of the Auto Troopers. His uh, rank is uh, 7, uh, Intelligence 6, Firepower 9, and Speed and Strength uh, 5 each. But yeah, you can see he is a Cybertronian battle tank, which I'm referring to. He comes with a Quake's gun. He is, of course, based on uh, Titan's Return Sl Slug Slayer, which I have actually done up on in a style of the Siege line. You can see what a little battle damage right here. Uh, yeah, this gun is removable. He is still a Titan Master, though. You can, I will show you Thresher's head. You can see it's a breakaway head done up in the same blue as uh, Slug Slayer's. But uh, Transformation, I have actually reversed it to uh, make a new character and like not give him the same back. So basically just, all I have to do is like rotate, it's all backwards, kind of like trigger happy. And just like take the arms out, rotate them around, take the waist and turn it backwards and open up the chest right here. And uh, say it with me now, head to on. And here we have Thresher. And you can see uh, from head to toe, I did add a few minor touch ups on well, more in alt mode, like uh, some silver right here. Uh, from the back, you can see I had a little silver for some thrusters right here. He does come with Quake's gun because, like, he's a Viacon. And you can see now he's uh, looks much more different. And this is one, uh, as long as it doesn't resemble any character, it's fair to play. Now, for comparison, here is uh, Siege Megatron. And you can see the scale quite nicely for a new character. But, yeah, uh, that's about it for this uh video uh let me know what you think of the challenge uh you can uh check you gotta tag people once you're done so spread the good word i guess but yeah ninja boo uh tf fan geek and des molten you're up and maybe patriot prime maybe you'll do it but yeah that's about it Mass far sign off good luck and i will see you next time